Welcome back to Texas All Water Fishing. I am Ruben, your host for this fishing adventure. And uh, I was going through my footage and I realized that I didn't record an intro or an outro. Like, what was I thinking? I have no idea. That was, that's kind of weird. Um, most of the time I'm, I'm on point with that kind of stuff. But I went fishing. And I want you to come with me too. Now let me just paint for you the imagery and imagine you were there with me. We're backing up the boat at a local boat ramp in Texas City. It is about 4.30 in the morning. I'm meeting with Bethel and Tim. And we are going to be targeting some fish just before the sun comes up fishing overhead lamps right around a full moon we are fishing with live shrimp under a cork and we will do so throughout the day <laughs> did you get that image was that imagery spot on was it on point thank you for coming back don't forget like comment subscribe share and today's video is brought to you by yes beto he is a owner and uh and runs uh, intervention safety solution if you are looking for an innovative so safety solution you are looking for a safety solution then check him out uh, i'll leave his information below they do training they do a ton of stuff he's all over texas louisiana he's everywhere this guy is non-stop 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 uh, i would fish more with him uh, if he wasn't constantly working and <clears throat> constantly on the move all the time also, we have in the boat is Tim. Tim is a, a local plumber. He's out of Fort Bend County. So if you're looking for someone you can trust that is a plumber and you're in Fort Bend County, uh, I'll leave his information below as well. Great guys, great friends, and um, just couldn't wait. I couldn't wait to be able to get back in this boat, and I couldn't wait to get out fishing with the guys. He's holding down. He's holding down. He's holding down. What is that? What is that? I never seen one of these before. What is this? <laughs> Give him the clippers. What is this guy? Have y'all seen this before? I never seen one. I need a fish ID. Where's Facebook? Put up. Hey, take a picture so we put on Facebook. Get a fish ID because I never seen this guy before. Yeah, it's a drum, yeah. Little drum. 17, 17 incher. Little black drum. Seen all day. Where's where's it at? Right at that corner. Oh, outside. okay, that one. I thought y'all saw another one. So about to put a croaker on. I think he has a gar on now. It's kind of pulling line a little bit. They got real hard mouth, so you gotta let them eat. Do you feel him chomping? Better? No. No. He's just holding it, huh? Yeah. Where's he at? He's over here now. Mm-hmm. Somewhere. He's right here by the boat. It's got to be a gar. I mean, it could be a big red, but we just seen we seen like three gars out here. It's kind of slow bite too, so we'll see. Yeah. Set it. Set as hard as you can. Watch out, too. Go. Don't break your rod, though. Set it hard. Don't hit the canopy. Go, go. Set it big time. Big one. Real, 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 real. Oh, oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> All right. Make sure your drag is good. Nice. Hopefully it's a big red, but might be a little gar. 
Oh, 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 don't let him get in there. Too late. No, that's a big guard. That's a big guard, good. Oh, oh that's a big dark one. Dude, Tim. look, yeah, look, you see Tim. how you got him in his mouth? You got. You need to get a rope. You got a rope? Tim, come on, Let's lasso Tim. him. Get him, Tim. We get a rope. You got to wrap the rope around the line, and then we're going to lasso him. Tim's a, Tim's a pro. Oh, 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 no, don't mess with it. Hurry, Tim, hurry, Tim. I know. I know, hurry. I need you to get with Betos. It's awesome. You're going to freak out. Yeah. And the thing came off. Look. He's off. Oh, oh he's it. off. Dang it. He's got off. <laughs> Dang it. Damn, I wanted him to. I was trying to get his tail. Dang it. I was trying to net him. Right on, man. That was fun. That's Woo! cool. <laughs> hey, you got him to bite on a little croaker. Yeah, some of us, he was pulling, he'd been pulling them down, pulling it down. Finally got him. A little red. It's a croaker with a spot on his butt. Oh, down again. There we go. This guy's a little better. Oh, that's a nice red. I think. Yeah, that's a Colorado. Yeah, that's going to be a nice one. Oh, he's undersized. Dang it. He felt so good, though. He might make it. Well, I'll undersize it if you want me to. In the grass, they keep cruising. I could see little bait, but I didn't see nothing chasing them. That's a Colorado. Keep yeah. Colorado. I just see a little bait. See, watch. Keep watching. You see a little bait, so I just. I just. I don't see nothing hitting it. So maybe they're not feeding. Maybe they're not feeding that aggressive. You know what I mean? But they're here, you know what I'm saying? They're not feeding that aggressive because last night was close to full moon, so they probably fed all night. But look, look what they're chasing. Mullet and shad. So you offer them something different like a shrimp, especially a big shrimp, can resist. 21 and a half, 21, 21, 21 incher. He, to what go with that, that black what drum. That? What's that? What's what? Oh, that's the um, whisker. Colorado. <laughs> Colorado. <laughs> Got slapped. Are you fishing? <gasps> Tim got a flounder. Look at that. I'll walk up to you and you catch a fish. Look at that. Feels like a mud. That. Look at that. I walk up to you and you catch a flounder. He got a flounder. I walk up to him and he has a flounder. It's a nice flounder too. You might need the net. It was one of those ones with a pointy tail. Get him up here. Oh, that's a nice flatty. Woo-wee. Look at that. I told you, Tim. I told you. Look at that. That's, Tim been that's a slam for touched. That's, that's, no, that's a slam for me. Ooh, he's curvy too. Look how curvy he is. Oh my goodness. Did he keep? Look at Curvy. Yeah, he should keep. Yeah, he should keep. He's a fat son. There we go. That's either a big trout or that was a That's big, a big old lady. ladyfish. Cause she's a lady. Dang it, I just retired not too long ago. She got to tear up my dang line again. I got some grass. Y'all want some? <laughs> you got some salad? Oh, look how big that lady oh, is. Dog. Oh, get out the thing. That is a big, That's a big lady fish for being back here, too. Uh. Here, here, hold her. Look how dark she is. Turn her a little bit. Look at her mouth. Why is she so dark? Look at that, Tim. 
You seen one? Look at her mouth. Cause yeah, she's a lady. She got a big one. Quink. There we go. Wing, wing Holy shit. Is that a stingray? Nuh-uh. Might way? be a little red. That damn motherfucker fighting like a two in the too. Little Colorado? Yeah. Our big gap top. It's a red. That is a little Colorado, dude. Ooh, it's a pretty one, too. It's nice and golden. That's that dead shrimp. Nice, stinky shrimp. Yeah, he's he's sea slot. Yeah, nice one. <laughs> yeah, baby. I told you that dead shrimp. That's the ticket. It's a ticket on these on these dirty days. That was like 23, 22. Under with the dirty water and the slow bite. Jim, take the other ones out. Let's get them right out. They can't resist. They can't resist that stinky shrimp. Other, what? other shrimp. <laughs> other shrimp. That's it. What we got right here. They can't That's resist. A tiny shrimp. How much? Let's see where he's going to be at. 22? Yeah, 20... What is this? 1, 2? That's not like almost, almost like, like 20, almost 23. Color almost 23. Say, I told you. Gorgeous. I told you he was 23, 24. But hey, that is going to do it. You know, I had a I had a tremendous amount of fun. I had a lot of fun. You know, before the trip was over, we did stop. We stopped at Fish Spot, which is right there in Moses Lake in Texas City. If you never fish or been to Fish Spot, there's a boat ramp. There's a public or a private boat ramp. You have to pay. But there's a, a boat ramp that's open to the public. Uh, it's privately owned. And there's also a restaurant. Now, this is a nice little suite hole in wall i guess you would say I, I hate saying that stuff but i like hole in walls i really do um great food great atmosphere we stopped there we ate some i ate a burger uh tim got a i ate a burger uh beto got a burger and he also got fried shrimp and tim got the um philly cheesesteak which is the philly cheesesteak is really good and the guys that they love like the the all the seafood stuff too um I me mean, typically I, I get the philly cheesesteak or i'll get a burger but anyway fish pot great place to try if you haven't and like us we were on the water so we can just mosey on over there and they have a spot where you can just park your boat and walk in and eat and then get back out and do some more fishing or you can kind of do like we did we left for the day but um i had a good time i really did really had a great time uh a lot of shrimp is uh is pushed into that marsh right now there's a lot of shrimp pushed into that marsh um you know, we haven't had much rain, so that, that shrimp is holding on back there. A lot of mullet, a lot of shad, you know, just a ton, a ton of red action. You know, those reds are starting to school right now in the marsh. So if you're a marsh fisherman or a marsh angler, uh, if you have a, a boat that you like to take back there or a kayak you like to take back there, now's, now's the time. You know, they're, they're heating up, you know, typically when you start running to the fall, you start running to a lot of those nice reds, but they're now. So um, if you're thinking about going... You definitely should go. 
But thanks, guys. I appreciate each and every one of you. Don't forget, if you want to be a patron of the channel, there's a link in the description section for that. Like the video, leave a comment. All that stuff really helps the channel out tremendously. And until next time, hopefully catch me hooking up. Thanks. Thanks.